Am I the asshole? For telling my daughter I can't support her life decisions? I have been married to my wife Diana for 25 years and we have three kids, Johnny, Sally and Hank. Sally has decided to drop out of college with one year left. Both Diana and I were shocked when she told us since she's been obsessed with her field of study biology and ecology since she was 12. We asked her why and she said that her and her friend were going to start up an online business and she doesn't feel that she needs the degree anymore. I will admit that I was pissed since I paid for most of her college and she only had one year left. If she were a first or second year I would have understood but the finish line is literally just around the corner for her. She asked if I would give her her last tuition payment as an investment. Important to note here is that my wife and I have been putting aside money for college for our kids since we decided to have them and made sure they knew that we'd help them pay their way through college. I told her flat out no, that money was for college and that's what the agreement was for when she got into college. I do not support this decision and I will not let her throw away the past three years for something like this. My wife agrees with me on this and has been trying to persuade Sally to change her mind for the past few weeks. Sally thinks that we're being unfair and that we're reneging on our promise, and we're assholes for not supporting her. Are we? She expects you to financially support her business idea, because you were offering to financially support her way through college? Not the asshole. Someone is feeding her terrible information about how life works. She could put in one more year of college, graduate with her bachelor's degree debt-free, and is dropping out for a risky business venture instead? Your daughter is, and I will say this as kindly as possible, not exactly demonstrating sound decision-making skills here. Not the asshole for keeping the college money. Not the asshole. She's not at college anymore so no more payments toward college. Not the asshole. She really should finish her degree and after that she can do whatever. And the money was for college, it was not hers to spend whichever way she wants. Not the asshole. College is an historically safe investment for a better life. The online business is an extremely risky venture and requires a whole different level of risk assessment. Ask for a business plan for the online venture and make them prove they can make money at it and then consider backing it. Not the asshole for all intents and purposes, you invested in the business of her college education, which failed. There are no assurances that this new business will not fail. Wow, talk about an entitled attitude if Sally wants to start a business, that's on her. You don't appear to have said you were interested in any investment except for your kid's education. You might let her know that the money will be there when she wants to finish her degree, if you're so inclined. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. The money was for college so if she quits it reverts to you your wife to use however. I do think you should stop criticizing her decision, but to refuse monetary support. She's an adult and the consequences are hers to handle. Maybe her business will succeed, maybe fail. Wish her luck and then take a big step back. Not the asshole her not finishing her last year was her choice but you not funding her decision is your choice. Not the asshole, I think you don't need to not support her but I would be firm that this is the path she is choosing and she needs to find the capital to start her business. Like getting a loan. The money you set aside is for school only. That it will be there if she plans to return to finish her degree. Also make sure it's not an MLM. Not the asshole, she's made an awful decision and she shouldn't expect you to finance it. Not the asshole. I don't think you're reneging on anything. You agreed to pay for college, and that's what the money is for. Not for an investment for some business idea that may or may not even pan out. And then what will she do if she blows her tuition on it? Nada. You promised to pay for college, not her online MLM business what not. Tell her when she's ready to complete the degree the money will be there. Not the asshole. Why can't she start the biz small whilst finishing the degree, then go all in afterwards? Not the asshole. The money was for college, she decided to drop out, therefore she doesn't get the benefit of the money. 
Not sure why that is hard to understand. Natar with a year left she needs to push through so at the very least she has a fallback plan in case it doesn't work out. Not the asshole. The money with for college not just a lump sum for whatever they want. Not the asshole 100 you are completely in the right on this. The money was for college not a get rich quick scheme. If she is insistent about starting this business I would make a compromise with her if you're able. Tell her that when she gets her degree if she still wants to do this then you will invest but only if she finishes her last year of college first. Your title is a little misleading. You promised money to pay for university and since that's no longer in her plans, she's not entitled to the money. If you mean supporters in financially, not the asshole. I hope you're not completely turning your back on her in anger over her choice. Not the asshole. I know this is encouraging and enabling but can you try bribery? You'll give her X dollars as an investment if she finishes her degree? I know you shouldn't have to but hey I've bribed my toddlers to do stuff and maybe that doesn't change as a parent until they're fully independent. Ask her what percentage of the business you own and what return you can expect before saying no. I mean 10 of a startup could be nice. But not the asshole. Info what's her degree in? Because, let me tell you, I have a bio degree and it hasn't done jack shit for me. She might be onto something, especially if she didn't want to continue past her bachelor's degree. I'm concerned her friend is trying to swindle her for your college tuition money. Definitely not the asshole. Nope. The money is for college. She can use it for college. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Not the asshole you must have raised a daughter with balls of steel to even ask Jesus crust. Not the asshole your money and you can decide what it is used for. Hard not the asshole, you promised her an education not money. To know enough about the details to really judge if your support would or wouldn't be a good idea. Maybe you are just being very conservative about it and stuck in some sunk cost fallacy. Maybe her plans are ill-conceived pipe dreams. If she does quit, I think supporting her and investing if it's sound is advisable. After all, you want your door to succeed even if it isn't on your terms, right? Not the asshole. You invested your money into a college fund. As long as you haven't won't distribute those funds for other purposes with your other children, you're good. It wasn't a financial gift for her to decide what to do with, you're allowed to make the rules about how you spend your money. Not the asshole. But you have another option. Sure, we'd be happy to use your tuition to purchase a 51 stake in your online business. I'd have probably just said no as well. Not the asshole. If you want to be generous I would suggest they need to present their business plan, market research, strategies on why they think it can be successful, etc. before you will consider investing into their business. At the same time I would also encourage her to talk to her faculty on how long her schooling credit is valid for before she will need to retake the entire thing if she realizes the online business is not successful. What's the business? I hope it's not a pyramid scheme multi-level marketing scam.